Hey guys, Blue 86 here, and you're probably wondering, hey, why are we doing? What are we doing here on the Wii menu screen? Uh, well, I'm going to be telling you guys this. I'm going to be starting a new Let's Play. Yes, my third Let's Play that I'm going to be handling. And what is it, you may ask? It's this little baby right here, Super Paper Mario. Let's go, motherfuckers. Super Paper Mario. Ah oh, man, this game. This game. Jeez. Where do I begin? By holding the remote sideways. That's where I begin. <laughs> Today, I'll tell you the story of the lost book of prophecies. This prophetic book was a mysterious tome full of stories of future events. Of course, many people create this book, wishing to glimpse their future. But no person, after obtaining this amazing book, ever found happiness. The reason? The book held frightful secrets, not meant for people's eyes. That book can be called the Dark Prognosticus and was sealed away. This is the tale of that forgotten book's last owner. It is a tale of love. And random text. And, uh, oh, oh, what happened to me? What is this place? <laughs> oh, you're awake, princess. Huh? Well, who's that guy? And whose eyes are open? Oh, it was Peach's eyes. And Bowser is there, too. Bowser! In a tuxedo? What is this? And... Holy jeez! Look at this party! Look at all the Goombas, the Koopas, and that number. What's going on here? Count. Yeah, um, okay, so preparations are complete. Mm. Then it shall be begun by Count Black. Bowser, ferocious and fearsome, evil king of the Koopas, do you take Peach to be your lawfully wedded wife till your games be over? <laughs> Will I marry Peach? Are you kidding me? The answer is yes! Peach, noble princess, pure of heart. Do you take Bowser to be your lawfully wedded husband till your games be over? Now wait just a second, you will explain to me what is going on right now! <laughs> is it not obvious? This is your wedding princess! But why in the world am I marrying Bowser? I've got Mario the fuck. <laughs> hey, no grapes from this side of the altar, Blecko boy! I don't get the details, but the Countess here has gone to a lot of trouble planning this. Just relax, we'll get married, we'll be in love, it'll be awesome! Finally! No, and who picked this dress out? It's awful! Take me back to my castle immediately! Oh, gee. Yeah, um, being rude to the esteemed Countess sort of frowned up, okay? So yeah, Princess Peach, I'm gonna need you to answer the count now. Do you, Peach, take Bowser to be your wedded husband so you're game for you over? Uh, no! <laughs> no! She sure are a fighter, but yeah, no one understands my super agencies, so... I do. Say it now, okay? Jesus! Oh, and you put it, 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 and that guy is... Hey! Oh, it's a big black heart that's oozing other hearts. Hey! 
<laughs> yes, all, pre all precisely as written in, in the Dark Prognosticus. Already it is unleashed. The Chaos Heart! Oh, yeah, um, congratulations, Captain. Hold! What the what? What the what? And just who are you? asked Chunk Black. Oh no, I don't give my name to a scoundrel. Just watch as Luigi punish you two for your beds! Damn it. Here I go! Yeah, I'm gonna need you to stop right this second, okay? If you interrupt this now. Hit Bowser! Hit the heart! Here's where Luigi rescues the Princess Peach! Eh? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, uh-oh. Oh, it's that book. Um, yeah, so you're... So are you alright, Count? Fools. Pointless acts like these will earn you only pain. And count back. Very well. As the Chaos Heart is secured, this ragtag group now lacks use. Um, so yeah, count. This means you may turn to a new page of Dark Prophecies. Open your mouth, darkness! Consume everything and destroy all worlds, as told in a prophecy. Blech! Gee, this does not sound friendly at all. And... Oh man, title screen! <laughs> so yes, welcome to Let's Play Super Paper Mario! So yes, I've actually been wanting to do a Let's Play of this for a while now. So... <laughs> because, well... I wanted to do this before Trevor Conroy actually started doing this. So... I'm gonna go ahead and do this now, since it's already been a thing now, and I don't see anyone else let's find this in, in the near future. So I'm going to give myself the name of Boohead, like everything else. Yes, and use this name. Yes, I would like to use this name. And also, here's another reason why I wanted to do this game. <laughs> Because, well, I wanted to do the other Paper Mario games, too, but, <laughs> here's the thing. My good buddy Extreme Travesty is doing a blind Paper Mario Let's Play, Paper Mario 1, and Lukagen and, Nint and Nintendo Capri Center are both doing Paper Mario 2, or The Thousand Year Door, which I, I, really, wanted to, I really wanted to do it in order, but... I, and I also wanted to do a blind Let's Play at some point, but I kind of held off on the idea, just because. Oh, and if you see those pictures that Luigi is sitting in between of, um, those are the, those are the partners from the other two games. So you can see Bo, you can see Vivian, I can see Bulberry. Um, I can see others, but it's very faint. Wow, so it's, sure it's peaceful today, eh, bro? Makes a guy feel lucky having a peaceable day. Yep, real peaceable. It's so peaceful, it's almost a little bit boring. Oh, here's a here's a better shot at the partners. I can see Cooper, Bombette, Mario. Um, let's see, who else can I see? I can see Flurry. I can I can see a little bit of the of the baby Yoshi. I can see Miss Mouse. So yeah. It's, Pretty much that. It makes you just want a uh, kerblooey, you know, some kind of shocking event. Ooh. Oh, at Princess Peach's place, maybe? That'd be cool, huh, bro? Maybe we should go visit Mush Mushroom Castle. It has been a while. I'm sure that the princess would be happy to see us. Oh, I can see Paracary too. And we're out, and... Never, never Mario! Help! And that toad... The toad? What? What's happened? Why are you sort of crazy? Um, don't be throwing that word around, Luigi. 
You haven't seen Dark Moon yet, boy. Come on. It's shocking. Mushroom Pit Castle raided. Princess Peach stolen. What? Why, that's ridiculous. Who in the world would do such a thing? Oh? Wait a second. Yeah, I think I've got it. Bro, this must be the work of that bad guy. That bad guy, you know that one bad guy? That always gets on our skins? Mario thinks, and he thinks so too. I don't want to stand for this. We are have to sneak into his castle and rescue Princess Peach. Let's go, bro. And they're on their way. We're counting on you, Mario Bros. Ah, oh, geez, it's gonna be a long episode. This is actually a pretty long introduction, if I do say so myself. Probably won't be playing until maybe about 17 minutes in. <laughs> Listen well, my elite minion, minion task force. It's time to initiate my awesome plot to invade Mushroom Castle. Today is the day that I make my beloved Princess Peach all mine. If that weren't awesome enough, I'll also stomp her little mustache buddies. Yeah! Whoa! Bowser! Woo! It's our turn! Whoa! We're under attack! <laughs> We're under attack! <laughs> We're under attack! You jokers are the best! Huh? Hey! Who are those hairy guys in the back? We shave around here, minions! Oh, Mario! And... Luigi? How'd you get in here? What? My front gate was open? How many times have I told these idiots if you're looking the... If you're the last one in, lock the gate! Quiet, you big Bowser. We know you kidnapped Princess Peach. Now, where'd you put her? Um... Are you sure she's in the bedroom? Where'd I... Wait, what? We're only now about to launch our attack. Mario, help! Oh, jeez. Here we go again. Princess the Beach? Yeah. Your princess has been taken by Count Black. You. Wait, by who? <laughs> How adorable. By me, Count Blech, the chosen execution, executor of the Dark Pronosticus, is Count Black. The fine fellow prophesied to come to this dimension is also Count Black. I'll tell you who doesn't make even a little bit of sense. Count Black! Oh, Bowser, try to get in the act. Enough! Release Princess Peach right now! I'm on a schedule over here. Count Black says never. This princess in, is integral to fulfilling the prophecies. She will be brought to Castle Black and used to destroy all worlds by Count Black. Destroy all worlds? And Mario wants to do something, but he can't do it now. Uh oh! Uh oh! Mario, no! Mario, no! Mario, no! Oh, Mario's done. Big bro! This man deserves ridicule. Weaklings cannot face Count Black. Hey, here's a thought. You calm down and free the princess, or else. Uh oh. Oh, Bowser's got him outnumbered. Oh, shit. <laughs> Your princess shall not be returned. By Count Black. In fact, Bowser. Evil King of the Koopas. Count Black will take you too! And Bowser's like, what? <laughs> Black. Yeah. And everyone's being taken except for Mario. <laughs> Count Black's preparations are now in order. 
All that remains is for the dimensional void to appear as foretold in the prophecy. <laughs> Jeez, you laugh too much, Black. I don't like reading laughing text. I don't like you wasting my King Boo voice for that. Ooh, rainbow text. Ario. Mario. Ooh, a butterfly! Quick, somebody give me a net! Right now! Come on, come on, come on! Give me a net! Give me a net! I wanna catch this butterfly! I wanna catch this on a bit! I wanna catch this on a bit, bitch! Not talking right but to you by the letter. Are you awake? My name is Tippy. I am what is known as a pixel. A sort of fairy. Mario, I came to find you. And Mario gets the wrong idea. I am no enemy. You met Count Black, and he captured a princess and an evil king. Is this not so? Yes. What is this, like fucking adventure time all over again? A princess and an evil king? Hmm, sounds familiar. Then that means Count Black is even now beginning to form the void. We haven't much time. You must come with me. Yes. If your friends are to be saved, you must come. What is this? Terminator reference now? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Is that a cursor? Let us go. Oh my god, that was a cursor! <laughs> it's a computer game after all! <laughs> Boohead says it's a computer game! <laughs> oh, who's that guy? Hello! Ooh, <laughs> start point. Oh, well, well, back so soon, Tippy. And who might this be? A shirt, blue overalls, and a magnificent stash. Um, not, um, you kind of have a pretty good stash going there, too, even though those look like clouds. Tippy, you have truly outdone yourself. He matches the description of the hero in the pr light prognosticus perfectly. And his name is Mario. Me? Me? I welcome you, Mario. This is the town of Flipside. You've come far from the Mushroom Kingdom of your dimension. Of course, Arthur Flipside is in no d dimension at all. No, it is between dimensions. Ho ho ho! My name? Merlin. I am a descendant of the ancients who created this town. I busy myself studying musty ancient texts to forestall the end of the the end of all worlds. What? Oh, uh, you wanna know about the end of all worlds? What's happening, you asked? So Tippy has not yet told you, I gather. Well then Mario, the answer hangs above you. That that small little purple circle there that has lightning bolts coming out of it? That's the answer? Do you see the gathering darkness in the sky? There's a hole in the very dimensional fabric of space. Such a strange phenomenon. Is it near or far? No, no. It may appear small now, but it will only grow. Are we rhyming now? Oh my god. What? what what's going on right now? And in the end, it will swallow all existence, all worlds, all dimensions. This void was created by our enemy, Count Black, who wields the Dark Prognosticus. A fair and lovely princess, a furious monster king. The union of these two will call forth the Chaos Heart, consumer of worlds. And the Chaos Heart will ravage the sky and so bring forth the void. Yes, the passage Tippy just quoted is from the late prognosticates of my ancestors. The book also says this, the void will swallow all. Well, no shit, Sherlock. Not can stop it unless the one protected by the dark power is destroyed. The hero with the power of the eight pure hearts will rise to this task, so it is written. Pure hearts. Oh, don't tell me. We gotta go get the Sailor Scouts, don't we?
All right, that one, I'll call him up. I'll call him up. Damn it. So many references! What, what, what? Is that one of them? This is one of the eight pure hearts. You are surely the hero spoken of in the pages of Light Pronosticus. You are the only one who can beat Count Black and save all worlds. Mario, take this and save all worlds from destruction. Um, I would say no, but that would be a waste of, like, 20 minutes. So, <laughs> I'm just gonna say yes. If you say a three no, if you say no three times, it results in a game over. Just saying that. Excellent! You truly are the hero of the Book of Legend. My ears, my eyes never deceive. Why did I say ears? So, <laughs> Mario, my brave hero, take this! Wow, we got a pure heart already? Is it the end of chapter? You got a pure heart! The pure heart has been thrust into your possession. Now, great hero Mario, the first task awaits. You must take this pure heart. You must place it in the heart pillar in this town. Tiffy will lead you there. Return to me when you are through with this task. This way. Oh, we're finally getting some instructions here on how to play the game. We are playing now. Woohoo! And wow, wow, Mario jumps really high. Especially when you run. Jeez. Jesus. So I'm just going to go ahead and fall down the cliff. Ooh. The hard pillow is this way. Come on, please. And I believe it is right over here. Yep, Tippy is directing us there. This is the heart pillar. Now, get close and place the pure heart. Um, okay. So we're just gonna put that in. Whoa! And Mario just jumps out of nowhere! And the pure heart has been placed. I thought we were going to have to look for this one, but I guess not. And... Looks like... The door to the first world is open! Well done. Now let's return to Merlin. Um... Can I say maybe later? <laughs> I'd like to end this episode, maybe. This is gonna be... Well, this is gonna be as long as the other... As my other episodes have been, but it's still pretty long. So, we're... Second floor. Okay, is there a safe spot? Ah, there is! Hey, hey there, safe spot. Perhaps you should strike the, this block before we head back to Marvel. So, yes, I will save my game, and I will call it an episode. Maybe I'll record another episode. I like really soon or something, but, you know, if you uh, like this episode, you should probably like it, because it's the start of a brand new LP! And if you love this episode, you should favorite it, because it's Mario! And it's Paper Mario! And if you love my commentary, and you love my work, and you love my videos, and if you love me for some random reason, then I encourage you to play and subscribe! It's free and easy! Don't push the button at the bottom of the video! And remember, each time you subscribe to Blue 86, you get a free bag of Reese's Pieces! Woo! No, wait, these are mine! <laughs> I will see you all in the next episode. Good day.